guys, welcome back to my channel. It's uh, me, Elena here. If you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Elena. I make really mediocre videos and subscribe for more mediocre content. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing a large-ish summer collective haul. I've been wanting to do this for a long time. Really got a chance to do it, but it's summer basically every day in KL. So I got most of these clothes from the beginning of the year onwards. And honestly, looking at it now, like I did not shop a lot this year. The majority of the clothes are from Shopee, AliExpress, and some are thrifted. This is also going to be kind of like a style with me video. So I'm going to show you guys what the clothes I got and then later on I'm going to show you guys how I style them because I don't know, I think that's more fun and I've been really into fashion. Um, I would say as you can tell from my Instagram but <laughs> you can. Anyways, without further ado, let's get on with the video. It has rhinestones, this baby girl on it, and then at the bottom it has like a super cool detail. Next thing I got was blue cardigan. I think you've seen me wear this before in one of my previous vlogs. Next thing I got is this kind of like green. I've been super into green recently, by the way. Super basic top. I needed more basic tops, so I got that. Next thing I got from AliExpress was this white hoodie cropped one with a double zip, and I'm pretty sure it was trending at one point. I'm sure you can still see my hand, yeah. It's pretty fucking see through. Like the material is not the best. And I expected it to be like thicker for some reason But this is also another brand new Marvel dupe But it's AliExpress So like Why am I speaking as if I expected it to be I don't know It is very lightweight Which is perfect because I got this mainly for like the gym I wanted to wear this over like my sports bras Because I needed to get more like cover up Since the material is super like thin I think this would like fit perfect for its purpose The last thing It's this blue like bodycon dress And dude This fits so so well The material is super stretchy Okay so now we're moving on to Shopee. First item of clothing is actually what I'm wearing on right now. This is just a Brandy Melville inspired top. Basically on Shopee you can get a bunch of Brandy Melville dupes but yeah it's basically lace. From Shopee was this tennis skirt. So tennis skirts have been super in recently. I've been wearing this tennis skirt quite a lot. Like honestly guys just hop on to the whole tennis skirt trend because I don't think it's gonna go away anytime soon. So just get them in white and black and you are set. You radiate Pinterest energy white tennis skirt you can really just pair anything with it and then i'm paired it with this really nice dainty top then a white bag to finish it off yeah i think this is so cute honestly but you know what look really cute this outfit wait wow now she really a sporty girl wow long socks and like air forces that would be pretty cute like that's a vibe this will also look really cute not gonna lie like I got two. These are like beautiful plaid skirts that I think everyone should have. First one, it's blue on blue. The material is actually relatively, it's actually thick. Like, I don't know, I didn't expect the material to be, you know, the best because obviously like Shopee. For those who are wondering what the fuck is Shopee, it's basically the Southeast Asian version of AliExpress. It has shorts underneath as well, which I think is super useful. This is how the plaid skirt looks like on me. I'm um, not gonna lie, they're way longer. So, <laughs> this is extra small and it still fits me extremely big. Like. Paired with this tank top, this lace tank top from Shopee, soft girl vibes. Yeah. A green and white plaid skirt. I saw this color combo and I really needed it because this year has been interesting because I've been super into green. Next item from Shopee I got was this super cute mint green or pastel green cardigan. Kind of like a straight neck and you unbutton them in front. I'm sure you've seen this outfit combo like 10,000 times but I paired these two together so you guys can see how it's gonna look like. It says, yes, this is the outfit I envisioned but this skirt is honestly just so fucking big on me like... Next item, floral dress. Material's great, it's thick, it's super cute for like lunches or like brunches. Next up are these corset tops. I got one of them from Shopee and one of them from AliExpress. Basically the same top, that one has a zipper. The black one has like little buckles. And I'll show you guys how I style this one in the try portion. Okay, so for those who are wondering how I style this corset top, remove the straps because this little thing, I would tuck it in. I paired it with this skirt. I really like this outfit. I got it from Uniqlo, I think. I think I had it since I was like probably 12 or some shit. And yes, I can still fit in the clothes that I wore since I was 12. Anyways. Next thing I got from Shopee was this super cute white baguette bag. Super simple and affordable. Looks like this. I feel like I can fit so much shit in here like my power bank, my cables, my cards, my keys. I just wanted a bag that wasn't particularly branded, you know, so I could just, you know, match with any outfit I wanted to and I decided white would be a good color because, I don't know, I just had a vision of going all white one day, so 
The next two items I got are basically, yeah, I got bibs. I already wore this on my Instagram post, but it looks like this. A kind of like cowl silk top. I'm sure you can see a bunch of them on Princess Polly. And all these other famous boutiques, but like they don't ship here. So we got it in black and I got it in white. This is how the black one sits on me. I think it's honestly super super cute. I am indeed backless. I don't think I'll ever be able to like wear this out out because I don't know, I think my mom would like kill me. But it's cute for Instagram, you know? I think it just fits perfectly like around the chest area and just falls so nicely. It's really versatile and you can really dress it up and dress it down. Okay, finally we're moving on to my thrifted clothes, but first item is this super cool long leather jacket. I thrifted this for such a good fucking price. This is the back. It fits perfectly on the shoulders and lengthwise it fits me perfectly. The first thing that drawn me into this was just like the fit of it all and the length on me and how it fit on me and I was like, dude, I need to get this top. I think another thing that would complete the outfit is probably the leather jacket that I thrifted. Wow, okay, I see you. I feel like it's just the perfect amount of oversizedness, but yes, I would pair it with this. It's a fucking cool ass outfit. If KL wasn't so fucking hot, you bet I'll be rocking this outfit like everywhere. And the next thing I thrifted was this pair of trousers. Um, they're basically men's, I believe, size 28. Okay, I don't know if they're men's or women's, but they're size 28. I decided to get it because the lengthwise, it fits me perfectly. And the only thing that's an issue is probably just the waist. Like the waist is the only thing that was big. They are brown, they are relatively flared. Next item I got was this black razor bag tank top from Zara. I think it's from the limited collection. It's basically just a staple that everyone should have. Like, I already paired this with so many outfits. Yeah, it's just a good stable to have. This is the Zara tank top and I paired it with the thrifted corduroy pin. As you guys can probably tell, like, I need to freaking alter these, but... Okay, obviously in public, I'm not gonna fucking wear, like, the shoelace thing. I'm probably gonna alter these. But in the meantime, this is what I envisioned when I bought these pants. There you go, it looks so much better, but basically, perfect amount of bagginess on me. And let's just ignore the back part, but I'm gonna lie, even with the leather jacket on, I think it'll look really cute. So sure if you guys can tell, but yes, this is indeed brown. Cute, like, every outfit that I would actually wear. The last item I decided to put in this haul. When I first wore this item out, I got so many questions via Instagram, via real life as well, on where I got this bag from, and like, and I got so many compliments on this fucking bag. But basically, you guys already know it's the infamous Nike basketball bag. First off, I did not make this bag. No, I did not make this bag. Got it as a gift. People are wondering, like, what the fuck? Like, it's actually really, really malleable. Like, it's pretty fucking soft, and it feels like an actual basketball. Um, it comes to two straps and one more strap. This is the bag. It is from the Instagram Tommy Studio and basically do a bunch of cool like basketball bag inspired like but yeah this is the bag I got. They do ones with like Nike bags and like football bags like that's really fucking cool. It has two zippers and this is how the bag looks like. It's just a hollow. It's literally like a hollow ball. Um, This is the crossbody chain that it came with but I don't think I'll ever use it. I'm probably just gonna carry it on like my arm but I usually just carry it around like this. I can probably put like six power banks in this and but yeah I can fit a lot of shit in here. For those who are wondering where I got it from I'll link the Instagram down below and yeah but this is my all-time most favorite 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 bag. Okay guys so that's it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed this little mini haul. Mini was it really mini? I don't know but yeah I spent actually two hours basically the whole day just filming this video and now I'm probably gonna go edit it. Also I'm planning on doing like how to shop on AliExpress slash Shopee because I don't know like I feel a lot of people got really, really, really surprised. Well, they used to, not anymore, but they used to get so surprised when I would tell them that my whole outfit is literally from Shopee. But yeah, I'm that bitch. I'm that girl. I'm planning on doing the type of video because I feel like, I don't know, like you can get so much shit on Shopee and AliExpress. Like you just need to know how to shop, I feel like. Yeah, but that is it for this video. I hope you guys give it a thumbs up. <laughs>